Hello my friends, well guys, new update! This is probably the most waited update in a long time. It's been a lot of delays, but here it is. It's been, uh, it's been around since this morning, so I had a quick look at it and I actually looked around on all the on Discord and everywhere and people are not really too impressed by it. But what I want to say is this is actually a great great addition. I mean the the equipment 2.0 it's it is here it says there but it's absolutely very good if you think about it now when you get your e equipment it's not gonna be like oh another piece of equipment what am i gonna do with it um it's uh it's just gonna stay there no now that helps to upgrade something else plus you can use your old ones it's exactly the same you can still upgrade them so it's not like you lost anything but before we talk about that a little bit more later um, you see, there's the, the legacy equipment that will stay there. It's not, it's no longer obtainable, but everything you had, it can still be upgraded, it can still be leveled up, it can still do everything that it did before. Um, we got two new equipments for specific units, and one is for the mad scientist. We're gonna look into that once I get it. I don't have it yet. Loads of improvements and bug fixes, and then it's gonna be some uh, bugs that we still, well, known issues that are still there. So, so far, my first look into equipment, I think it's extremely cool. It brings a little bit of diversity as well, where none of the units are going to be exactly the same or if they are someone went through a great deal of hassle to do it so that 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 makes some difference so i got those equipments there just from raiding you can see i have three of them that's the the, the legacy one we're gonna go through this small tutorial so you guys know you can see the colors that's a different color and the green one is the legacy one it's the equipment that you had before or well, if you just started now um, it's something that was before it was just the, the, the raw version of 2.0 so you can even re-roll the stats on the on the equipment I'm gonna show you exactly so if we look at that that's a common one you can see it's level 3 I leveled up already I want to see how it works and the veteran XP boost is plus 3% if I wear that on any of my units um, you can upgrade loads. I'll show you the upgrade. It looks quite good the screen. I think um, You can put another one uh, Into it. <clears throat> so every time when you get one equipment now it can be used straight away to upgrade your original one that uh, That's something that I do really like because the Thousand of equipment that I had and they had no use for it It wasn't even worth it to actually scrap it to get uh, the materials because you are gonna get the common material and you can see it's loads of them there so yeah that's all the stats there it's a, it's a, it's, a <laughs> it's not easy to get your exact um, stat that you would like I'm not sure how rerolling the stats will work I, um, I didn't really try it to be honest with you um, but here we go we got toxic resistance plus one percent it's in that bracket there uh, this is the level this is the common equipment now the rare one is gonna have two uh, slots for two extra bonuses and the legendary one is gonna have three slots we're gonna go through that once we get one we'll try to get one anyway but so far, this makes perfect sense to me. I, I can work towards something, I can check my rewards at the end of every battle, and in case it's, an, it's a piece of equipment, I'm gonna be happy about it because I can use it straight away. I mean, it's, it, it's something that changed the equipment anyway. It was something, it was lacking before there, I think, in my opinion anyway. Um, it was hard, and it's still hard. And as you can see there, you can actually get rid of loads of them at once, it's easier and all of that. So the reroll uh, substat, I'm not sure how it works. I think you will need the same equipment and it has to be the same level. Unfortunately, I just uh, 
scrapped one earlier. I had two <laughs> the same, but it doesn't really matter. We're gonna we're gonna figure it out. I'm gonna put it in the comments for you guys once I figure it out myself a little bit more. Um, we are gonna. I have 300 plus gems, so um, there is some crates in the shop. Now, before we go to there, guys, those equipments they are all obtainable. I'm not sure about the legendary ones, but most of them are obtainable through battle, like as a battle reward. There is a statement there, just check your, your news and you're gonna see. I think the higher the level you are, uh, the easier you will get them. Anyway, this is the new Alliance Season Store. We did speak about uh, equipment quite a lot. This is quite cool as well. You're gonna get those golden tickets through the um, the event. I'm gonna show you in a second. There is some things to help. I really, really like that exchange. If I have too much gold and I do need munition, I can go quickly to the Alliance store and do that. This is the way you get your tickets, prepare for war. Uh, I didn't really manage to claim them all, or claim any anyway, but I think um, it will be enough to get you to the season. That's how you get your alliance, uh, extra alliance battles. That's uh, that's quite interesting. I, I, it's, it's a good addition in my opinion. Now those are the new things to buy if you want to buy. That's the equipment crate key. I'm not sure about that. Uh, as I said, I don't really know much about it. But I'm gonna buy two of them and let's see what we get. Let's see if they are worth it. Um, and maybe buy more later we see how it goes so you get two equipment and you get some materials straight away that's good that's good 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 it's a good crate in my opinion uh, if you are looking to upgrade you if you are looking to be the best basically oh we got a legendary it's a headhunter badge unfortunately um, that's not <laughs> really any use to me but this way we can actually go back and see uh, what we can do with the legendary and how he looks and how the stars are and all of that. I'm actually quite happy with that. So this update, I think it was expected to be massive, but um, the 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 addition to the game is pretty cool in my opinion. I actually really like it. So you can see, um, I'm gonna upgrade that. I'm gonna just keep pressing. You can, it's good that uh, now even the the common material or uncommon whatever it is um, it kind of worth something because we used to have thousands and thousands now I do regret not scrapping all my uh, <laughs> all my uh, equipment before so I could have like 30 40 thousand of that because it would have helped me a lot but is wise so there you go we unlocked it until level 6 for now I won't really, really waste my material on level 8 I don't really need it you could see we got two stats there then I suppose eventually you can re-roll that but I do uh, use the discount so if I plan on replacing my legacy discount on any units I'm gonna upgrade this uh, for now and see what uh, what equipment uh, substats we get but again it's I think it's, it was made fair if it wasn't uh, to have the old ones, the legacy ones, as you can see there, and then just start from scratch, yes, some people worked a lot, but you can still use those. I think I saw a picture on Discord earlier with a level 20 equipment, I think you get level 13 or 14 on a new one, so that works out somehow like 50%, between 50 and 70% you get back. So if you eventually decide to get rid of all your legacy equipment, you can upgrade a new one to level 14 with a level 20. It's not that it doesn't sound that fair, but considering you can still use them and they are still doing the same thing except the sub stats. Um, if you want to push it to the next level, that's the way to go. So you can see two there, very good. I'm very happy. It's something to add on. Now, those might not be the substance that I need. Um, well, there I'm gonna try to figure it out how to re-roll that and how to get the stats that I need. But this opens up to a lot of new tactics, a lot of uh, trying to work towards something, in my opinion. So, yeah, 
the battle pass is not that great in my opinion because I have the mercenary fully upgraded but the rest the equipment itself I think it's, uh, it's very good so you can see you can still upgrade your legacy ones it works absolutely the same in actual fact it works even better because you if you'd had loads of um, of the other equipment the other material the the common or uncommon whatever is common one um, it will work absolutely amazing for you because you won't need the other requirement that it was before so um, battle pass I said it earlier this is a mercenary battle pass it's uh, great it has two legendary two unit only equipment in it or one whatever is there but I wouldn't get this because well, I wouldn't get it like I would get the one before where it was helpful to towards something because I do have the mercenary but considering that I do need tickets I do need armory tickets so I might get it and see how it goes um, I think it's, it's quite uh, interesting anyway battle pass are they are helpful because you do get crates at the end if you are playing the way I play it's helpful to me anyway every every item that is in that battle pass is gonna w go towards something plus everything that's uh, the all the the boosts that you have throughout the season so that's that's quite good I would uh, I would really like to get it anyway but yeah you have um, new achievements as well as you can see there so overall, in my opinion, this update is absolutely amazing. It's not what we expected because it was a long wait. So I suppose we just build up the hype for uh, and we didn't obviously didn't meet our expectation. But the new equipment, I think it's absolutely amazing. It does the trick. You can get it. Uh, I'm going to let you know, guys, more as I play and as I learn a little bit more about it. But until then guys that's everything for this video i hope you enjoyed and if you did please leave a like let me know in the comments as well what do you think about the new update as i said i have seen a lot of uh, discussions on uh, on everywhere actually and some people are not happy some people are happy let me know what you think and guys that being said thanks for watching and i will see you next video